Hi Sips, just wanted to say hi and T he been watching you since dig and rig when you had a terrible mic and talked for five minutes before starting to play the game. Yeah. Also Oak Resin looks like an angry bomber man, cannot be unseen. Rip. Like an angry bomber man. So the large purple eggs I sell. Okay, gotcha. Gonna do it. Large purple eggs. Gotcha. Sell them. Gonna do it. And the large purple milks as well and all this stuff. Look at this fucking shit is incredible. Uh, we're just producing like there is no tomorrow. And we got plenty of time to make it to the park. We got plenty of time. We're just wasting a bit of time. Wait, is it a new week? Yeah, it is! It is. Alright, we're gonna hang on to this apricot. No. We're gonna hang on to the apricot. Sell this crap. Okay, and we're gonna go do a, a wine and apricot delivery. Do you think Pam would like some wine? You did good with this one, kid. Thanks. <laughs> she, yeah, she fucking loves wine, actually. Look, she's she just like uh, completely hammered already. Harvey, are you out here? We're doing a speed run. We're gonna do a speed run down to Emily's house. Deliver one apricot. Hopefully, we don't have to have some weird story where she's having a dream about me being a yoga instructor or whatever. Thank you. No problem. Hi, Bert Reynolds. Hi, Emily. Okay, now it's time to deliver some wine to Harvey. Because can you divorce people in this game? Like, is it possible for me to just have, like, Harvey living with me in Holy Macaroni just for, like, the season? And then after the season's done, I divorce him and then get with Emily instead for the next season? Like, is that possible? I feel like that's probably possible. What did you think of that, Harvey? Hmm. I'm struggling to make ends meet. I keep spending all my money on stupid toy airplanes and instead of reinvesting it into a hedge fund. I love you, Sips. Oh, love you too. Thanks, um, Wacko2k. Thanks for the donation. Also, Ninja Fawful. Thanks for the 250 bits as well. Okay, I'm ready. 12 p.m. I got it! This is the right one, right? Okay, if it's not this one, it'll be the other one. It's about to be 12 p.m. We did it! Hey, it worked! You received a Junimo plush! Wow! It's huge! Okay, so... On the 28th of any season, we can go back here and we can get these plushies. Oh man, it's huge! Oh, this is fucking great. Nice. Hey, Harvey. Got a plush for our house. It's only a matter of time now, bitch. It's only a matter of motherfucking time. It's only a matter of time. We got it. We done it. Since I'm home from work, yeah. I followed your suggestion the other day and started doing all the drugs. Right. Tonight I'm going to inject cocaine into my dick. Also, <laughs> how much did you pay to have ass hair transplanted onto your head? Fuck. Um, not as much as you're gonna pay to get um, cocaine injected uh, into your dick. I don't know if you realize that's not like the uh, the done thing normally. You usually have to pay a bit extra. But, um, good, but good luck and have fun. Um, and I'm glad that you've decided to try the drugs after my suggestion that you go out and try the, try the drugs. Anyway, thanks very much. It's Hackenstrom. Um, I appreciate it. And I look forward to updates on your date with Destiny. Cocaine in the dick. God damn. You're in for a real time. I said I wasn't going to produce this stuff, but you know what? I'm just going to produce it. Because why the hell not? Right? We need the money. I don't want it. No. And actually, spending time in this shed is very fun. I feel like this is a little bit of an easier way of doing it. Okay, perfect. 
We just gotta wait for this last keg to finish up and then we can move the kegs in and maybe make some more kegs. Because actually this stuff is uh, gonna sell like hotcakes. We're gonna have to grow lots- in the summer we're gonna grow lots of berries. It's gonna be fucking sweet. You mark my words. It's gonna be sweet as hell. Yeah. Purdue. Purdue. If you have artisan or a rancher perk, it's better to sell cheese mayo instead of purple eggs and milk. I can't remember which one I took. Does anyone else- does anyone remember which one I took? Is it important to be aware of that? A vampire walks into a bar. Right. The bartender Lucas a little worried, but asks him what would he like. A cup of boiled water please water? I thought you guys drank blood today I'm in the mood for tea, says the vampire while taking out a tampon. Oh gin, that is disgusting. <laughs> that is disgusting. That's such a gross joke. Fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's kind of funny too, but man, it's pretty gross. I was not a dad joke. I can't re like I, I have to go to my in-laws today, and I can't repeat Merry that one. Christmas. That's not one that's going to be appreciated at all. I need I need something better, Jin. I need something better than that. Good lord, How do you guys get these jokes. That's what I want to know. Hey man, hey. Nikki Six from Motley Crew injected heroin into his dick. Really? Take a ride on the wild side. Yeah, hero heroin and cocaine are different drugs, man. Like, uh, heroin into your dick. Oh, man. Just even just saying that, I'm imagining a syringe going into my you dick. You are my hole. happy place, Sips. Also, can and you recommend fuck. any good, reliable fridges? Um, no, I'm too busy thinking of the catastrophic pain of an in a dick injection right now. Oh, God, it's uncomfortable. Oof. God, that would hurt so bad. What is that sound? And why is that stuff going in there? I don't get it. Um, Sipsuck69, thanks very much, man. Uh, reliable fridges? Uh, I'd go for i I'd, I'd, I'd take a look at a Kenmore. Um, see if you can find a Kenmore fridge. They're pretty good. Um, I think you can also get nowadays. I think um, you can get a really good um, Kenmore. Is uh, a is a good brand. Something that you might want to bear in mind. And um, I think you can get them at Sears. Go to Sears and you can buy a Kenmore uh, fridge at Sears. They're they're really good. And uh, also, you can get those old style fridges with the clasps, like they, like the retro fridges. They're, they're back, uh, but they're safer because you can't actually lock yourself into the, those ones. They've, um, they've like done some design iterations on it or whatever. Um, so you maybe get one of those. Uh, you sound like, you sound like you're just like um, about to become a dad. These are all like very typical dad questions, like. All of a sudden, you, you realize that what you What do you a call a man under a pile of leaves? A fridge. Russell. What do you call a man with a plank of wood on his head? Edward. What do you call a man with a spade on his head? Doug. What do you call a man without a spade on his head? Douglas. Nice. <laughs> those, those are great. I, I, can, I can definitely use those at a family gathering. Thanks. Not so much the vampire tampon one. Um, Jesus. This stream brought to you by Sears and Kenmore. And Kenmore, yeah. Big, uh, big shout out to Sears and Kenmore for, um, sponsoring this stream. Um, actually, we have a, a word from our sponsors, um, that I have to play. Hang on a second, let me just get A man it meets his favorite the... rock star in the street. I'm your biggest fan, he exclaims. The rock star responds. If you were really my biggest fan, you'd be hanging from my ceiling and blowing me. Right. Not quite a dad joke, but I hope you liked it anyway. Kenmore fridge. Kenmore elite refrigerator problems. Troubleshooting a refrigerator not cooling. Sears parts direct. All right, here we go. On. Let's check the power cord and the outlet. 
Obviously, you'll want to make sure that the refrigerator is plugged in and the power cord isn't damaged. Then make right. sure that the electrical outlet is working by plugging in a lamp or some other appliance that makes noise. If your outlet's broken, you'll need to have it repaired by a qualified electrician. Right. Once you confirm that your refrigerator is getting power, the next thing you will want to check for is excessive frost built up on the evaporator, which can inhibit cooling. Right. You may need to troubleshoot issues with the automatic defrost system if the evaporator is caked with frost. Yeah. This video will walk you through that process. It's dripping. If there's no frost on the evaporator coils, let's move on to some more advanced checks. Most refrigerators, like this common Kenmore model, have a diagnostic... Hang on, guys. These are advanced checks, okay? Get your notepads ready. Ready? Diagnostic test mode that checks refrigerator operations. First, we'll check to see if the compressor and evaporator fan run in the test mode. To enter the diagnostic test mode on this Kenmore model, within two seconds, press the light switch three times and then press and hold it a fourth time until you hear a long beep. You're now in the test mode. If this Whoa. doesn't work on your model, check. Whoa. A test mode? On my Kenmore fridge? What the fuck? Your tech sheet for instructions. Jesus. You can usually find it located behind the bottom front grill or taped to the back of the refrigerator. Press the door switch twice to start the compressor. He just pressed it twice. The control beeps twice, then you should hear the compressor start. If you don't hear the compressor turn on, check the start relay on the compressor. This video will show you how to troubleshoot issues with your compressor. Fuck. That's some fucking crazy shit right there. Um... Thanks, uh, dumb fist for the bits. Slinky, thanks for the donation as well. A man meets his favorite rock star in the street. I'm your biggest fan, he explains. The rock star responds, If you're really my biggest fan, you'd be hanging from my ceiling and blowing me. Not quite a dad joke, but I hope you liked it anyway. Um, nah, I did like it. Sorry, I wasn't listening. I was listening to the Kenmore Fridge thing. There's no ads for Kenmore Fridges. I guess it's like they're one of those appliances that are so ingrained into our minds as being like a good old reliable wholesome American appliances that they don't even need to advertise anymore. You just go to Sears and it's just like, Hey, look, looking for a fridge. Sounds like you need a Kenmore, boy. Uh, you know what? I do need a Kenmore. Fuck, where do I get one? And then they just wheel out a Kenmore, put it into your car. And then they hold a gun against your head and um, they say, now give us our money. And then you have to use a credit card, pay for your Kenmore, and then you go home and you're done. Fucking sweet. I like that. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. All right. The spring is over, guys. That means that tomorrow is a full day of, you, you guessed it, crop planning. Level 8 foraging. Nice. We have a warp totem farm now. Oh, that's useful. That's fucking great. That means I can just like warp back now all the time. I wonder how much it costs to craft those. I don't even need a stay. Oh shit, did I not go get the parts, the uh, wood today? Shit. First of summer, year two. Look at our house. It's hilarious. What the hell? Um, weather report? It is going to be clear and sunny all day. I moved it. Oh, shit, I moved it. Ah, crap. There's a torch in the way. Oh, I forgot I put all these torches back here. <laughs> crap. Okay, live fortune teller. Instructions unclear. Better do their best. Put clock in fridge radiator. Ah, shit, shit is now broke. Did you Send do that? Help. All right, did you actually, you actually did that, Jackie Chan? Because I did that to my car one time as well. Thanks for the donation. Marv Hot, thanks for the 100 bits as well. 90-year-old man asked pharmacist for his Viagra prescription and if he could cut the pills in four. The pharmacist asked why in four. The old man says they are not to get an erection. I just don't want to pee on my feet. Oh, my God. Jesus. Okay. Uh, I've heard that some folks stand near moving trains together any debris that falls off. Wow, the things people will do for a freebie. Merry Christmas. I've done that so many times living off the land. You wouldn't believe it. Wait, is it because it's a new season? Okay, no. We need to give an apricot. Oh, wait. We're not going to get apricots now because it's summer. Thank God we stored up all those apricots. Now we can still give apricots to Emily all year round, I think. 
I didn't make any jam or anything with them, did I? Please tell me I didn't. No, I didn't. One apricot. Perfect. Okay. Nice. All right. Let's figure out what we want to do with the crops, and let's actually get this set up so that it's better. Oh, look at this. Devastated. Thanks for that good old-fashioned, family-friendly, wholesome advice about the fridge. Yeah, no problem, man. Anytime. If you, go, if you need anything else, Sipsuck69, you fucking, you let me, you let this guy know. I know all there is to know about a Kenmore fridge. Very wholesome, all-American Kenmore fridge. That's right. All you Americans out there, you know what I'm talking about. Probably, probably just looked over into your kitchen right now and said, you know what? Fucking this guy's right. I got a Kenmore. Me of all people, I've got one. Unbelievable. Oh shit, we got work to do today, though, guys. It's Monday. We need to go buy some seeds from Pierre. Seeds of change. Um, we also need to... Ooh, we're gonna go upgrade our house, too. Um, we're gonna go speak to Robin after we've been to Pierre's. Or maybe before. And we're gonna upgrade the house. The next upgrade of our house. It's gonna cost us 50 G's. And I think we needed, like, 100 wood? Or was it hardwood that we needed? I can't remember now. But anyway, we're gonna go find out. We're gonna go... We're gonna fucking find out, and we're gonna rock the socks off this season. That's right, and hopefully we're gonna have somebody to marry and live with us as well. No need to do any fishing. Uh, I like told a... her not to get her hopes up. After True. all, I say, we're only going to be celebrating it for half a minute. When she asked what in the world I was talking about, I pointed out, this is your 32nd birthday, how do locomotives know where oh, they're shit. going? Lots of draw. Lots of training, lots of train, not not lots of tra. Jin, I don't know why, but she just cuts you off every time for some reason. Um, hi, Bert Reynolds. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. It's Willie. Hi, Bert Reynolds. It's odd. I'm not sure what caused this boulder to disappear. Oh, I know exactly what happened, Willie. This stream is flowing from deep within the mountain. Oh, what's that? Hey, do you see that glistening in the water? I sure do, Willie. Yes, that's a quality ore. Hey, Mr. Sips, have you ever smelt mothballs? Me neither. I can never fit my nose between their legs, frown. Frown. <laughs> Benjamin, thanks for the donation. It's a repeat, sadly. We've had that one before. And Jess, thanks for the bits as well. Have my last bit, Sips. Quick question. What's the clumsiest thing you've ever done? Um, I don't know. What's the clumsiest thing I've ever done? Have I ever, like, accidentally dropped something or... I don't think so. I don't think I've ever done anything overly clumsy. Tripped. I've never broken a bone. I've never, like... No, I don't think I've done anything overly clumsy. The flow of water must be carrying it out of the mountain. Okay, so I can fish up ores now. You know what this means, right? No. It means we can start panning for ore. Oh. Here, I've got an extra pen in my backpack. Why don't you take it? What the fuck? Really? If you ever see ore glistening in the water, use that pen and see what you find. What the fuck? Really? I got a copper pen. Sure. Hey, have a nice walk. Fuck you, Robin. I'm working on the horse stable, for Christ's sake. Jesus. Okay, let's upgrade the house. 150 pieces of hardwood. Oh, shit, it is hardwood. Alright, let's construct some farm buildings then. Uh, we got the deluxe barn. We got the deluxe coop that we can build. We need 500 and 550 wood. Oh, wait. It comes with an auto-feed system. And it unlocks rabbits as well. Holy shit, rabbits! Sheep and pigs. Okay, this is what we need to be getting. The deluxe barn. We need the pigs. We want the truffles. Uh, so we need some more wood and stone. Okay, fine. Robin, we'll be back. We're gonna go for the deluxe barn. T-Y-V-M, okay? That's exactly what we want. Um, and we need this pan as well. What the shit? Oh, we need to go to Pierre's and get the seeds too. 
We need tomatoes and we need melons, I think. Is this the last thing? There's also the bulletin board that we're missing a bunch of shit from. Like duck feather. Where the fuck do I get that? Sunflower. Try to do that as well. Poppy? Oh, yeah. We we have some. And we have a, a truffle. We're going to be able to get that from the pigs. Fodder. Wheat and apples. Okay, our apple tree should be ready pretty soon. A rabbit's foot and a pomegranate. Okay. All right, sure. I think we're I think we're good. Where where's that glistening? Oh, it's gone. I wanted to pan it. Now we, now I'm going to be looking all over the place for these sparkling uh or or things. Okay, fine. Fine, 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 fine. It comes from a duck. From duck. You you have to kill teagles for the feather? Do I actually have to slay one of my ducks to get these this feather? I haven't seen a duck feather yet. All right, I'll go to Pierre's. I'll go to Pierre's and buy the buy the stuff that I need. Hi, Pierre. Do, do. All right, so we definitely needs we need melon seeds and we need lots of them because this is part of the um Tomato. Okay, last Taste. one. Thanks for the last sip. Continues sips. to produce. What's okay, blue nice. and not heavy at all? Continues Light to produce blue. as well. Um, no, you, Jin, that you're absolutely right. What's blue and not heavy at all? Light blue. Yeah. Oh, wheat seeds. Okay. Takes four days to mature. Harvest with the scythe. Okay. We can get some wheat. Radish. Takes six days. Poppy. I've got some poppy seeds already. We just need one, one poppy. Spangle seeds, tropical flower, hops. Producing after that. Is that what I need for the for the ale? And then corn. That goes all the way through and continues producing as well. Okay, so melon I definitely need uh, for the quality crops. I need five gold melons. And then for summer crops, I need tomatoes. So we will definitely get some melons. I think let's go for like we'll get like two two lots of those and then tomatoes let's also get like <sighs> let's get like lots of tomatoes shall we because they're pretty good and then blueberries as well it takes like 13 days to mature but I think we're gonna go for like a bunch of these too because we want to make uh, jam and wine and stuff as well right so we'll buy all these two pepper seeds. We need some wheat seeds as well. How many wheats did we need? 10? Is it 10? I think I have enough sprinklers for all this stuff. And the rest of it, red cabbage. Oh yeah, I got that already. Grass starter, um, fertilizer, the quality fertilizer. Ooh, catalog saplings and stuff I think I've got everything I need for now okay fine we're doing it we're off we'll go give Harvey his wine since he's he, he's due another one where is this wine it's right here oh he loves it man he loves wine what are we up to with him now three oh man okay Emily we're at three as well it's 11 a.m. We still got a lot of the day left. Don't worry, guys. We're all over this. We're not going to let the day get away with... Get get out of reach of us. There's no seaweed in there. Emily's probably just in her room, right? She's Does she just sit in her room until it's time for her to go? Yes, she does. Okay, perfect. Thank you. I'm feeling positive energy from this gift. What are we up to with Emily now? Still three. So we, So next year we can dance with them. <laughs> in the spring if we really want to for fuck's sake jesus is streaming hard sips should i try it would you watch me i'd watch me i'd watch me hard dumb fist it's not you should try it man let me know and i'll watch you all you got to do is play play a video game and talk while you're playing a video game that's it that's it that's all that's all you got to do no Nearly noon, still haven't planted my first seed. This will be tight. No, come on, what are you talking about? We're all over this. 
We got this totally under control. Okay, we're gonna move this stuff down here though. We're not gonna have crops up here anymore. Okay, we don't want this tree here either. Or this wood. I don't know how this stuff snuck in under my radar, but we're putting an end to it right now. And this little one too. You get out of here. And this wood too. No, 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 no. This can move. So that means that we can take the scarecrows with us too. We're not going to have any crops up here. It's going to be trees and stuff. And in here too. It's going to be trees. So stuff can go too. Okay. And then we're going to replan all of this stuff down here. And make it better. We're going to line it all up properly. We're going to fertilize all of it. We're going we're gonna to plant our crops really nicely in an organized manner. And then we're going to put the scarecrows up as well so that we can protect the crops. It's going to be great. I hope. Look at all these rare scarecrows that we have. It's nuts. Okay, let's cut all this stuff out here. That's right. Perfect. Fuck, I can't believe how much hardwood you need. Is there nowhere else to get hardwood? Like, can I not buy it or something? I have so much friggin' money. It's nuts. Okay, so this is all going to be trees up here. We're going to plant like a mini forest that we can just chop down whenever we want to. And then the tap stuff will be above it. And then all of this space here will be for sprinklers. Except for like that no man's land. We need a, we need a clean slate here. We need a clean slate. And we have we need a path to like go down to. Okay, let's move these out of the way. We want to make some uh, these nice ones here. So we need like it's like fifteen or so of these, I guess. Oh, eighteen apparently. We have eighteen fucking sprinklers. Wow, jeez, that's a lot of sprinklers. Crap. Okay, and then we're gonna need our hoe. Um, so we want the hoe. We want to start hoeing from about here. This is this is gonna be farmland in here. Merry Christmas. Oh, and we also want fertilizer as well. So we're gonna need some sap. Perfect. Okay. Okay, nice. That's good. We'll have another one um, right beside it, I think directly beside it horse attend me you can have robin build you a stable and get a horse you can ride around the map much faster i know i'm doing it i'm working on it right now ish <laughs> kinda okay we want to we want a gap here though so it needs to be like here yes perfect are you going to get another goat at all or am i sitting here with my tiny dick in my hand like a jabroni well, you are a jabroni, it's true. Um, yeah, no, I'm gonna get another goat. I, I'm, I'm, I've got other things to do right now. I don't know if you noticed, Guppy. I'm kind of busy. <clears throat> uh, Mink of Bane, thanks for the sub. Gif and Snaffin, thanks for the donation. And Guppy, thanks for the bits. Don't worry, Guppy, I got you. You're gonna, you're gonna be goaded. I'm gonna goat you up. Good. Oh, look at this, guys. This is what I'm talking about. This is perfect. We can have a path that's going to come down here. Look, we're going to make a path. Oh, this is great. Okay. This is this is what I'm talking about. Right here. This is this is the dream. Okay, we're going to have sprinklers. This is going to be the entrance into our new our new farming land, okay? We're going to have this path. It's going to connect up here. We're going to make some more of these nice tiles, these weathered floors. I really like these a lot. They look pretty good, I think. I like because they're solid. They look better than the uh, than the planks. Oh yeah, yeah, that's nice. Looks like it's got like some edging to it as well. It's pretty nice. Can I just? No, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we want to connect it up now. Oh, yes. Oh, that's nice. That's what I'm talking about. Now we can get in here. Here we go. And then we go like this. Oh, yeah. Great. Great. 
Man. And we can get all the way to the back here with like these little corridors. It's gonna be nice. And then can we actually Oh you can. Look what you could do with the no man's land. Oh that's good. Okay, that's really good. Okay, we're gonna need way more of these now. Um uh, where are they? We'll go with like 40. Um, okay, perfect. And then we'll have these like little bits in the middle here because that they look pretty good too. And then so on and so forth, right? All the way down. I guess we can upgrade the hoe pretty soon too. Might be useful. Okay, what are we planting here? And also I need some fertilizer. We're just going to go with the crappy stuff. We'll just we'll just start with the crappy stuff. It's probably fine. It's gonna take forever. Okay, so up here I'm thinking we get we plant like I don't know blueberries. Oh, I didn't get enough. I have to get some more actually. Oh, it's too late to get some more now. Okay, blueberries can go in here. God, we're going to be farming for days at this rate. It's going to take forever to get this all set up. It's going to be pretty sweet, though. Okay, so the rest of that will be blueberries as well. Uh, we're going to have to water this stuff as well. But that's fine. And then tomorrow, from tomorrow, everything will be watered automatically for us, which is pretty good. I think we can just do this, and it's actually better. Okay, this is good. Oh, nice. It's like all my dreams are coming true all at once. It's incredible. I think we wasted a bit of fertilizer though because we're not going to be able to plant any. We want like all the crops to be the same across, right? Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Thanks very much, uh, Brady B20 for the sub. I appreciate it. Welcome. Um, we're going to get some um, blueberries there. We'll get some melons as well. And then the tomatoes. We're gonna have to stay up most of the night tonight, I think, doing this, because we wanna be we wanna make the most of it, right? In the morning. We wanna get off to a start, because it takes like a couple of days for this stuff to, to come up. And then I'll go get some more seeds from Pierre tomorrow and then we can finish it up completely. Come on, fucking fertilizer. Jesus Christ. Okay, what's this one going to be? This one's going to be tomatoes. We're going to do tomatoes here. Tomatoes being one of the ones that we need for the for the bundle. And then melons, the other one that we need for the, for the bundle as well. We want to get those growing like as soon as possible. Okay, nice. It's so late. Here I am at 10.20 p.m. Farming, uh, as usual, because farmers don't get a rest in this world that we live in now. That's they've been. They're 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 overworked. They can't they can't make it work, without working twenty four hours a day, seven days a week. They never get a day off. Poor farmers. Um, and then I think we what we do is we go like down like this, and then we do one, two, three. So one, two, three. And then we, yeah, see what I'm saying? It'll be like a parking Merry lot, Christmas. except it's going to be for, um, for crops. Okay, perfect. How many seeds do I have for these? I have 16, so I'm going to plant melons tomorrow, I think, once I get more. So actually I needed 40, I needed 40 of each. So I need to get uh, eight more blueberries. I need to get uh, eight more tomatoes. And then I need to get a bunch more melon seeds. And then I can, I'll grow some other stuff down here too. It'll be great. And then it, I'll get some trees and stuff planted up here. Merry Christmas. But I'll, I'll separate it out with these little like uh, rows as well. Okay, perfect. And then all this stuff can go. Oh my God, it's so late. I just want to get rid of all the all of these though so that it looks better so when i wake up in the morning i'm like really thrilled with how it all looks fuck i didn't see i didn't even attend to these guys at all <laughs> today i didn't pick up any of their shit nothing 
I need to feed them. Oh shit. We're running out of time. Oh, chickens. Please. No. Please. Please don't die or anything on me. Do I have time to feed the cows quick? Oh, I don't know if I do. It's it. I'm gonna pass out. I gotta go to bed. Oh. Hi, Sips. Yes. Looking I, smashing as always. There's too much Hope to do. You have a great day. Oh. Greetings from Sweden. Fuck. I think the cows are all gonna be dead. Shit. What a busy day. Fuck me. Um, thanks very much, Gen Bay Stream, for the um, for the donation and for the kind words as well. Also, um, ASDFDC, thanks for the seven month resub, and uh, Mr. Kanko, thanks for the nineteen month resub. Thanks very much. Fuck, what a day! There's too much to do. All right, we have to attend to these people now, the chickens and stuff, right? I'm going in. Hi. Hi. It, I am still here, chickens and, and ducks. I'm sorry for neglecting you so much yesterday. Didn't even love you nothing. Please move out of the way. Look, look, Teagles is fully grown. He, he's, he's grown already. That took no time. Okay, that's annoying. He's not even any... Pick up the fucking egg. Holy shit. Pick it up! Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck! Get out of here! Oh, my inventory's full. Fuck me. <laughs> Fuck. Fucking... F the fucking... The fucking chickens and the fucking ducks everywhere. Fuck off. That's so annoying. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. <sighs> God, let's put all this crap in here. It's because I've got all of these fucking scarecrows and everything in my inventory as well from yesterday. Like the most stressful day of all time. Jesus Christ. Finally. <laughs> oh shit. These fucking stupid chickens and ducks. Man. Do we just replace them all with, um, what's like the highest thing that you can get in here? Do we just sell all the chickens and replace them with ducks? Because the duck mayonnaise is worth more, right? I'm thinking, yeah, that's what we do. Ah, oh, shit. Man, these cows are gonna be so pissed. They are so mad. Oh yeah, of course, we don't have a full contingent of goats yet. I guess we gotta get on that. Oh my god. Who is this? Mad, but he's still he's st he still produced milk. You get a duck feather from a duck with one or more friendship. Also, Emily right. can gift you one if you marry her. <gasps> really? Okay. I'm definitely going to do that. I'm definitely going to marry her. I want to marry that Emily. Marry that girl. Marry her anyway, I'm gonna marry this girl. Marry that Emily. Um, thanks very much for the tip, Guppy. Sorry for yelling. I feel so bad now. I think we're gonna need to get the grass started. We ran out of grass completely. And look at all this, like, huge field of grass on the other side here. I'm gonna be so pissed. Okay, where were we up to? We got you. We got you. We didn't get you. Fanny Fart does not have any milk. We got you. Okay, perfect. And third cow. So we're actually burning through hay right now, which is not the best. I'm going to have to go buy some seeds, and I'm going to get some grass starter while I'm there to spend the money. Oh, yeah, look at that. Okay. And the fields are, are coming together. So what was it? We needed eight blueberries. We needed eight tomato seeds. Wait, let me put some of this shit away first. Um, fuck, we're gonna need like way more. Oh, I need to hang on to like some of this stuff though, annoyingly. I forgot to put that milk away too. Why do I have no like inventory space? Okay, let's just put all the rare crows in here for now. And I'll come back and get them after. 
when we actually need them. And then that way. Wait, what are these seeds? Oh yeah, wheat. Okay, we'll do a we'll do a line of wheat as well. So we need 40 for each row. That's right. And then five, ten. So we could do three. We can make some more sprinklers. So I can do like a couple more rows as well. It just stops making milk after a while. What? What's what does? What stops making the milk after a while? That can't happen, can it? All right, Pierre, here I am. Good day. Um, okay, so we needed eight of these. Um, we need... Melons. And then where are we at with wheat? Okay, perfect. So that's another row. Radishes? I don't know if we want radishes. I mean, we could maybe do some corn or something. Hops might be good. I guess we need that for what? Oh, sunflower seeds! Okay, we need some sunflowers. They take eight days. Well, let's just make a couple. Who cares? And then grass starter. We, we're gonna get a bunch of this. It's kind of expensive, but we sort of need it uh, for the outside. And then everything else I think we're fine for for now, but we can come back. That's more than enough work to be getting on with today anyway, to get those fields all set up and everything. Jesus, corn sells for a lot? Yeah, I guess it probably does. And the I guess the, the, the nice thing with corn is that if we plant it now, it'll just keep uh, producing corn throughout and then into next, um, in, in through the next season as well, right? You wonder if Pam produces sad milk? I've often wondered that myself, actually. Pam, do you produce sad milk? Perchance? Okay. So what was this? These are blueberries up here, right? I planted blueberries at the top, right, everybody? Tomatoes at the bottom? Yeah, it's, I totally did. Okay. Okay, there's blueberries. Um, we need some fertilizer here. Okay, and that's the rest of the tomatoes. Nice. Perfect! I love the music. So good. God, this is hard work. Holy shit. This is the worst. Remind me never to start my own farm IRL. This is just the worst. Fuck, there's so much shit to do. Did I do... I did all the cows and stuff today, right? I'm sure I did. Yeah, I did. Okay, we better start planting some grass around here. Come and... Get out of here, dumb fist. Come and get it! Rise and shine, motherfuckers! That's right! Look at them go! Holy crap! They're eating it like there's no tomorrow. Merry Christmas. I like uh, I like them having grass. I think it makes them happier when they're outside eating grass. You know. Maybe I'm wrong about that. Maybe I'm not. I could be wrong. I could be right. Oh God! I need some more stupid fucking fertilizer. Merry Christmas. Oh, nice. Okay. 
What's next? Melons. Okay, we definitely have to grow melons today. Get them watered up and ready to go. We need a big bumper crop of melons. Oh, shit, did I not get a... Oh, I missed the fertilizer. That's annoying. Fuck. Okay, we have to manually water them though. Today only. And trample the crops as well. I know I missed a spot. I can't believe it. So annoying. I was sure I got them all. Gosh darn it. <laughs> the nice thing is though, is this stuff's going to take like days and weeks to grow. So I don't really need to come back and check up on any of this stuff. Like I can just leave it and it'll just do its thing. Which is nice, actually. I have three sprinklers. I could do with two more, ideally, for the for the wheat. The row of wheat. Maybe I will just craft two more quick. Because I've got the materials for sure. Uh, one of those. Oh, no. It's not one of those. It's one of those, one of those, and one of those. One of those. One of those. One of those. I need two more. Okay, perfect. Nice. Okay, so we'll have the field done, and then we can get back to, like, chopping wood and doing all that other crap that we need to do to get the, um... We want to get the deluxe barns so that we can get the pigs, so we can start getting the truffles. We need truffles. That's one of the things that we need for, uh, Harvey, because we want to make the truffle oil. So we can give him, like, a truffle oil and a wine every week until he marries us. That's, that's the long play. That's what we're going for. Ah, shit. What the fuck? I wasn't even pointing there. What the hell? It's annoying. Okay, perfect. Oh, I'm gonna need some more of these as well. Is that three? Is that three? Yeah, it's three. No. How could you? Perfect. Okay. That's that. That. Okay, this time we won't miss a spot. Well, we'll try not to at least. Is that good? Looks good. It's time for wheat. <laughs> We have, um, what's it called coming in the summer as well? Apples. We should have enough apples for the bundle. Actually, so this summer is, we, we're, we're going to finish the pantry bundle, but not the uh, bulletin board one. Well, we might be able to finish the bulletin board one. I think the bulletin board one's a little bit harder, though. I guess we need rabbits for the rabbit's feet, or the rabbit's foot, and we need um, to start getting duck feathers as well, right? We got this. We'll be fine. We'll do it. Um, Skashman, thanks very much for the sub. Also, Free Spectrum, thanks for the 100 bits. Um, have I have a huge dick. Me too. It's uh, gigantic. Also, Dowie, thanks for the 21-3 um, sub, man. I appreciate it. Sips, I really like how your farm currently looks, but remember to find a place for your scarecrows. Also, I'm really bad at Gwent. Please help. Oh, I can't help you. I'm bad at it too. Oh yeah, Don't scarecrows. forget the scarecrows and also be careful of not planting a season-long plant in the middle of the sprinklers. Tits tee What is that? Don't forget the scarecrows and also be careful of not planting a season-long plant in the middle of the sprinklers. Tits tee A season-long plant in the middle of the sprinklers. In the middle. What does that mean? In the middle of the sprinklers. In the middle of the sprinklers. What the hell? I'm so confused right now. I don't know what that means.
Is that a large meal? It is. All right. Off we go. Off we go to make some some big wongas. Oh, like beans. Oh, I see what you mean. Like the with the with the poles and stuff. Is that what you mean? I just sort of glimpsed at chat, and that's what you're talking about. I'm gonna assume that that's what you mean, but I'm not too sure. Um, what else do we need? Oh yeah, we ah oh, the kegs. Crap. Let's get the kegs in there. Finally, the kegs. Okay, perfect. How do we have four kegs? I don't remember having four kegs. Um, what do we want to make? Crystal fruit wine. Oh, <laughs> or not. Crystal fruit wine does not work. Wild plum wine. No, what? Okay, wild plum wine it is. Perfect. And um I think we're good. We're good for the uh for the crops and stuff. We can do this. I can replace this stuff with the with the new path, the better path. Oh, that's so much better. Holy crap. Look at how great that looks. We spent a lot of time tarting up the farm today. And now it looks great. Oops, we ran out. Yeah! Oh, it's, it's just like this one little niggly bit at the end that doesn't look like amazing, but should be fine. Okay, so we've got all the stuff. Oh yeah, scarecrows. Okay, I'll go get them. Hang on. I think I I think I can put them like I'll show you what I'm thinking. Um let's go for like I think we could probably do it with four. I'm hoping anyway. Before we go to bed. We'll see. So I'm thinking that we could just like have like one there, one there, one here. And then like one here kind of wrecks the paths a bit, but like that should be enough to cover it. Right. I'm hoping, oh wait, Did something just not grow there, but it's seeded. It looks like it's seeded. Okay. Perfect. And the lightning rods, where do they need to go in relation to the crops? Like, are they cool to just go like kind of anywhere? I'm tired. Okay, I'm going. You like the turnip head scarecrow? What about this big apple? It's pretty good. All right. Oh, man. Jeez. Well, we made a lot of money off of milk and crap like that, so that's good. But, geez, that was stressful. The first couple of days of summer have been pretty stressful so far, but I think we're off to a, a start anyway. We got a whole bunch of stuff out, ready to go. How are we looking for these sprinklers? We can make another... I can refine another one of those. Um, and I need some gold as well. God, the fucking music is like so upbeat. Holy shit. A new baby duckling is hatched. All right, Guppy, you're up. You're gonna be, you're gonna be a duck, okay? Because I haven't bought the goats yet. Okay, that's it. I think we're at capacity in here now. Crazy. Oh, look at little Guppy. Look at little Guppies, a little baby. All the ducks are fairly happy. And the chickens too. Perfect. Okay, come on out and eat the grass. And now, for these bad boys. Good morning. It's time for me to shove my fists into your butt. Nice. Oh, rapid raccoon. What is going on? Why is this cow's udder so red? 
It's like inflamed. It's got an inflamed udder. Pissbutt is the happiest goddamn cow in the land, it, it appears. Okay, perfect! Excellent. This is good. This is really good. This is really nice. This is exactly what we need. Uh, let's get some of these uh, eggs in here. Producing. And uh, milk too. Oh, look at these. These are just like normal milks, though, not large milks. So are we saying that these ones need to be made into, into the gold cheese? It'll sell for more? Well, we'll try it anyway. Fuck, look at the production in here. It's nuts, isn't it? Oh, yeah, and then we want to... Any, any extras we want to, like, chuck into these things here. So eggs. That's fine. We put the eggs in here. We've got lots of eggs in reserve. We have sunflower seeds to plant as well. That's right. Okay, we're going to plant those. Um, and do we have any spare milk? Yeah, we have some spare milk as well. Okay, perfect. Nice. Don't forget the hardwood. Oh, yeah, shit. Just another oh. fucking thing I got to do every day. I'm just trying to get everything else online here. Um, okay, so that we're, we're okay for that. Sunflowers in here somewhere. Pomegranate, apples, wheat. Okay, those are, those bundles are pretty much done then. Oh, poppy. We have to plant that as well. Is that There's a fall thing? Please, in my name, you big dumb dumb. Oh. But really, thanks for ducking me. Also, can you tell Pirin that he's a shithead from me? Sure, I will. Next time I talk to him, I'll make sure that I mention it to him. <clears throat> I'll call him the biggest shithead this planet's ever seen. Just for you, guppy. Um, let's put this stuff in here. Let's put some stone in here. Uh, let's make sure that we're constantly making this stuff as well. Um, gold bars. We're going to need some gold bars for some more sprinklers. Uh, I can't, well, I can plant the stuff, but I don't, I want to have the sprinkler system ready for the sunflowers, but maybe I just do like a manual one. Because they're sunflowers. I could just put them over here, right? Water them every day. I'm going to have like a flower patch here. For sunflowers. And I put all eight of my sunflowers in here. I'm going to fertilize this as well. And I'll put a sprinkler in there eventually too. And then I'm going to plant my sunflower. Where did I put the sunflower seeds? Oh yeah, they're, they're here. 